Okay, uh, so the camera just stopped recording without any alert or anything and actually kept playing for like two rounds. Uh, so I'm hoping I can just put this in one video. But anyways, I kind of just uh, put everything back to where it was when I saw that the video cut out. Uh, just uh, went back in time and uh, so I did not finish though uh, uh, yet. I was at the last round. And I was about to see if I won or lost. So, but this was the hand I had at the end of round five. We're, now we are going to. Uh, so we got faded, uh, and we are we're going to start our turn by moving this to round four. So, uh, so there. Now we can continue. So, <sighs> when I put um, Mrs. Judson down, uh, I did not. Uh, lose up to two power. I only had one. I have to lose it and uh, so I decided to move here to uh, use fidget to vanquish uh, Mrs. Judson and then I was able to gain two power uh, and I was able to move a card uh, and so I moved the robot queen and uh, let's see, I was able to play a card, so I did this to free up my hand a little bit. Um, and then I could not discard, so that was it for that. I went to see if I got faded. I did not. Went down to round three. Drew a card. And that was the new hand. And so I went, uh, what did I do then? <laughs> no, I forget what I did. Um, okay. Well, I think I went here because I have to keep moving the queen. Uh, so I got a power. Move the queen. Uh, then I think I, I discarded... Uh, everything except this one. Yeah, I discarded everything except this one. I kept this one. Um, so I moved, I gained power, discarded, can't do anything else. So, uh, I went to see if I got faded. I did not. Moved down to round two. Uh, drew back up to four. So I needed three cards. Uh... And let me see what I got. Okay, that's right. So then um, I moved here, got two power. And then this is pretty much where I was when I realized that the camera had stopped. Uh, so uh, I realized that I could uh, move the queen to here and that I could uh, so I got my two power, uh, I needed to, so I want to spend three power to play Felicia there, so I don't have to pay two extra power, because her ability, uh, I'm not sure if I showed this before, uh, when Felicia is played, uh, discard an ally, uh, from your realm, or pay, uh, two power, and you see she costs three, so in order to not have to pay more, I have to discard. So I'm going to discard the ruffians from there. It could be anywhere in the realm that I discard. And uh, now I'm going to f use Felicia to fate the queen. And now, uh, let me see. So I, I moved, I faded, I played Felicia, gained two. Okay, so I did everything. That's what I have in my hand now. And so... Uh, we're at the second to last round. Now, uh, I did not get to roll the dice, and I'm not going to roll the dice. Instead, I'm just going to automatically fate myself to see what happens. Discard and... Okay, great. So that means I will win, because uh, when Olivia is defeated, choose an opponent. That opponent reveals and plays the top card of the fate deck. So it doesn't matter where I put that, that would not prevent me from winning... And sabotage, discard an item with a cost of three or less from a location in Radigan's realm that has a uh, hero. 
the only piece that has a hero is this location, so that's the only thing that could be discarded, not the queen, because uh, she has a cost more than three anyway, so even if there was a hero, that couldn't be discarded. So really, there we go. I would move down to round one. That's the uh, beginning of my turn, if you see that. Let me see. Focus, focus. There you go. Start your turn with the Robot Queen at Buckingham Palace. It is the start of my turn. The Robot Queen is at Buckingham Palace. I win as Randigan on the very last round that I could have possibly won. Where is it? <laughs> very last round. Uh, so let's just see how many times I would have to be faded in order for her to have gotten uh, out of here. So let's see. Ah, and that's it right there. And right there again. So if we drew any of these two cards, uh, it would have gotten, this would have gotten Basil out, or if we just drew Basil, we would have placed him anywhere where the queen was at the time. So in this case here, that would have gotten rid of the queen, and this would have changed our uh, objective to defeat Basil. Uh, but that uh, did not happen. Fate was on our side tonight, uh, lost at the very end, on the very last round. Uh, with the Robot Queen starting at the bottom of our deck. So I think that went pretty well. Uh, I just wish the camera didn't cut off. Uh, but anyways, you know, stuff like that happens. But uh, that's actually where I'm going to end today's vlog. I love your beautiful faces. Be kind to someone, and I promise I'll see you tomorrow.